Hey what's up guys, this is Carty Fox, and today we're going to be building steam locomotive. So right here is the Cast Scenic Railroad Shea number 2, and it was a C-Class Pacific Coast Shea, originally used as a logging engine and was built as a wood burner, but later it was converted to oil burning and then coal burning, which it uses right now. So it's the only Shea to have been equipped with all three types of fuel. So uh, right now it actually still operates at the Cassinic Railroad State Park, which is a heritage railway in West Virginia. And they have a whole bunch of variety of other shays. And uh, when I was watching the video for this, um, <laughs> you can see like the parts over here, they kind of spin around in like a cool motion right here, like all these parts. So this is actually in like, it's built in real life as an asymmetrical engine. So the other side, they don't really have all these gears. Um, and like the boiler is like adjusted to one side. So that I, that's one thing I found very interesting about it. And uh, yeah, it's actually a commission by a Patreon supporter, CODBO2, RGM2. So thanks to him for making this video possible. And uh, yeah, let's get started on the build. So first off, we'll grab our materials. Take out nether brick wall, nether brick stairs, nether brick slab, and uh, we'll add in dark oak slab. Uh, what is this black concrete? And we got that new 1.16 block polished blackstone stairs. Uh, down over here, we'll add in um, gray concrete, a hopper, dark oak fence gate, and I guess that's it for now. So let's make the front area. All right, so first we're gonna take out nether brick stairs and we're gonna make uh, two of them facing outwards on each side, leaving a gap in the middle. Then we'll add in a dark oak fence gate in the front in the middle with a dark oak slab on top. Then we'll add in a nether brick wall, five blocks cross. And then onto this side, we'll add in a two by two of this polished blackstone stairs. And we wanna make it two blocks long. Then on top, we'll add in another brick uh, slab right here on this side. Then we'll move down over here, add in the pair of wheels, which is gray concrete, skip a block, add another pair. Then we'll add in another brick slabs across the inside part and in between the wheels. Then we'll add in hoppers to the sides of the wheels with a dark oak fence gate in between. The other side will do the same thing. All right, next we'll make a two by three of black concrete right on top in the middle here, like so. And then we'll add in a two by three of nether brick slabs. It's gonna be an upper slab. Then replace this middle area with a nether brick block. And then we'll add in three blocks wide nether brick slabs. And on top we'll add four blocks wide nether brick uh, slabs. And then we'll add in upside down uh, nether brick stairs, three blocks long. Then on top nether brick stairs, three blocks long and make this part cornered on top. All right, then we'll go onto the other side, add in uh, nether brick stairs. And then three nether brick stairs at the bottom. Then we'll add in seven blocks long of black concrete. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Go uh, back to the front here, add in black concrete right there. Skip two blocks and add another one, another brick slab on top. Then behind it, we'll add in another brick stairs. And then we'll add in an L shape around that stairs with another brick slabs. Then the side of this, we'll add in another brick um, fence. And then we'll add in this uh, bell, the Minecraft bell, right in front of this dome, like that. Side of that, we'll add in another brick slab, like that. All right, so next we're gonna add in black concrete underneath here, we make it four blocks long. Then we'll add in another brick stairs, four blocks long, to the side of it. Then we'll go underneath, add in five blocks long black concrete. And then we'll go on top, add three blocks of black concrete in the middle. And uh, another brick stairs. And this is going to be an upside down facing inside. 
that. The other side will do the same thing. Then we'll add in a case trap door on the side of it, close it up, both sides. Then on top we'll add in three blocks wide of nether brick slabs. And we'll make it four blocks long, so one, two, three, four. And extend the rest across like so. Then next we'll move down over here towards the front, add three blocks wide, black concrete. Then we'll make it so it's ten blocks long, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we'll extend the rest across. Other side. Then the back there's going to be another truck, so we'll add in the same wheel design, a pair of gray concretes. Skip a block, another pair. Add in the inside a plus sign of nether brick slabs. Hoppers on the sides of the wheel with a dark oak fence gate in between the wheel. And we'll also add one after it inside, right behind that wheel. Same thing on the other side. So on the inside of this, we'll add a dark oak trap door, like that. And a new block, this is a chain block, we're going to make it uh, vertical like that. And the other side, we'll add in a chain as well. Then on this side, we'll add a dark oak uh, trap door again like that. Alright, so uh, this side, we'll add in um, an end rod and also a dark oak fence gate. So add an end rod here. And then a dark oak fence gate. And then three upside down nether brick stairs facing towards the front. Then a nether brick wall. A dark oak fence gate. And then an end rod. Alright, then we'll add in a dark oak fence gate right above this back one. And then three nether brick fences. Dark oak trap door. Nether brick slab. Dark oak um, trap door again here. Then this upper part will add in uh, two dark oak uh, fence gates and then an andesite wall in that little nook. And as for this top section, we'll add in uh, three dark oak fence gates, and then two end rods. All right, and then we'll add in. Uh, right up here, uh, another brick stairs, gonna be upside down. And then we'll add a dark oak fence gate. And then three upside down, another brick stairs facing towards the front. Alright, now over here we'll add in two nether brick stairs, and they're gonna be facing each other. And then we'll add a dark oak trap door right up here, close it up like that. And we'll add in another brick slab right there behind it. So let's go back over here and we can add in the top part, which is uh, two nether brick walls. And then a dark oak trap door. And then another brick slab right up top. Then we'll add a dark oak trap door here and close it up. And we can also take out a black carpet and black glass pane. So we'll add in four black carpets right on top here. And then we'll add in three black stained glass panes right here on the side. Then we'll add in a black concrete right here in this corner. And we can also Add in the back of this black concrete, three blocks tall here. And then a two by two right behind it. So. Alright, then on the other side, uh, we'll add in black concrete underneath the stairs. Sorry, it's a little hard to see. I'm going to make an L shape, two blocks tall like that. And we'll add another brick stairs facing towards the front. A dark oak trap door right on top of it. Open that up. And then we can add in, um, well, we'll skip a block at black concrete. Three blocks tall and do it two by two right behind it. And then on top, there's going to be um, 
this row here of black concrete. And we can also fill in the inside of this with a block of coal, row of three like so. As for this back section, there's going to be um, two by three of nether brick stairs. And then on this side, there's like a little pipe that goes around. So that's three blocks tall of nether brick walls. I mean, fences. And then two dark oak fence gates like that. While the rest of this is going to be a border of nether brick slabs. Then on the sides of the cab, we'll add in black carpet all the way across the side. Like that. Other side, same thing. And don't forget on the side, we'll need to add another brick slab here. Add the carpet on top. So next we're going to line up with this dome here and add in another brick stairs like that. And make this go all the way across the side to the front. And then after it, we'll add in another brick slab. Dark oak. Uh, fence gate and then uh, another brick stairs right here in the back facing towards the front and the rest of the stairs facing outwards like so then underneath the stairs we'll add in a dark oak trap door and then another brick slab four blocks long and then right up here we'll add in um, two more dark oak and skates on top and we can also add in upside down um, another brick stairs all the way across here and then you see that little hole there that we kind of missed I don't know if you can see or not but this hole here we're gonna have to fill that in so I'm gonna temporarily remove this just so we can fill in that hole all right I think I think we got it all right so after we've done that um, let's add it two dark oak fence gates here. Open the first one up. And then we'll add in another brick fence, two blocks tall. And then two dark oak fence gates. Then down me up, another brick fence, and then dark oak fence gate. And we'll add in um, end rods. So take out our end rod. And we'll add that in front of this cab area. The one, it's gonna be, I guess, five blocks long. So it goes past the bell. And then we're gonna go a bit down and add in another three right here in the front. All right, so now we need to add in the chimney, the smokestack. We'll add in this uh, polished blackstone wall and gray concrete, dark oak uh, trap door on top. So we'll add that onto this side. So add in the wall, gray concrete, dark oak, trap door on top and then dark oak signs all on all four sides of this like that then we can add in uh, this black glass pane right on top of this nether brick stairs on that side all right it's looking good so far we're gonna go on inside the cab and we can fill in this area in with black concrete so it's all filled in like that all right, and then the inside of the cab, we also fill that in with uh, this light gray uh, carpet, make a two by three. And you'll see some coal here, so we're going to add in a row of three dark oak trap doors and close them up. So it's like a little wall like that. So on the outside, add in two blocks tall black glass pane right here. And also add in the other side, same thing. All right, so on this side, we'll add in the bottom two black concretes, and then a dark oak um, trap door, and then another brick fence, and add a dark oak fence gate in front of that, open that up, and make it two blocks tall like that. Add in light gray carpet on top, and we move up to the other side, add in two dark oak fence gates here, and open them both up and add in a light gray carpet on the inside of that. Then we can add in uh, this, I believe it's spruce button right here in the bottom corner like that. Other side, same thing. And we'll add in a black carpet across um, the exposed area on the side. I guess these two blocks like that, and <laughs> that's about it. 
All right, then we're to go on the bottom of this. And you see where we have this line across with um, another brick slab. So we're going to make that go all the way across uh, the middle section to the other side, filling this all in with slabs. All right, should should look like uh, like that. And now I guess we can um, get started on the tender. I guess the tender is very small, so we'll just add in a dark oak fence gate right here, sides, and then we'll add in a black concrete uh, row of three in the middle. And we're gonna make it five blocks long. So one, two three, four, and five, three by five like that. Add upside down another brick stairs in this front corner and make it go all the way across to the back. And other side, we'll do the same thing. And then we'll add in a row of five nether brick walls. A dark oak slab in the middle with a dark oak fence gate underneath it. All right, and then the sides here, we'll add in two of these nether brick stairs facing outwards, both sides. And then we'll add in a dark oak fence gate right after, uh, adjacent to the rails. And there is a chain, just horizontal like that, on the outer edge. I'm going to add in this wheel again, so add in a pair of gray concrete, skip a block, add another pair, and add in nether brick slabs on the inside of this. We'll add hopper sides and dark oak fence gate in the middle. Other side will do the same exact thing, like so. And then we'll add in onto this side uh, two end rods like this. You don't have to do this on the other side, just this side, because this is where all the gears are. And now we can add in, um, I guess, the tender. So that's going to be uh, five blocks wide of black concrete in the back section and also in the front section. In the front part, we're going to make it two blocks tall. While in the back, there is going to be this uh, oak slab in the middle of this. So in the back, we'll add in an oak slab right here in the middle. Black concrete's on either side and behind it as well. And then we are going to add it, so another black concrete on top. Then we'll add in uh, two blocks wide, black glass panes on the sides. While in the middle, we'll add three blocks tall of dark oak uh, fence gates and we're going to open them all up. Add another dark oak fence gate on top of the slab and open it up towards the back. Then we'll add in this item frame with a white glass pane for the lamp right there. The trick to place it though, like so. And then on the sides we'll add in um, three black uh, concretes with three uh, oak slabs on top. Other side, same thing. And then we'll fill in the in, inner wall with black concrete. And the top section is going to be nether brick slabs all the way on top. Alright. And uh, after we filled that in, we'll add a dark oak button. Right here, just two of them like that both sides so they're spaced apart all right so now uh, i think it's time to make um the banners to get the yellow stripes so just go to our chest here take out yellow banner black dye put in our loom and we'll make a stripe across the middle put that back in and a stripe across the top and the bottom and that's how you make the yellow banner it's really simple so just add one, um, actually two of them on the side of this. And then two on this tender here. On the other side, we'll add another two on the tender. And one over here on this side. Like so. 
Then we'll move down over here where this trapdoor is and we're going to make this go all the way across to the other side. Then we'll go right here in the bottom at dark oak uh, trapdoor in front of the wheels like that so that they connect and yeah that's actually uh, pretty much it on how to build the cast scenic railroad shade number two in minecraft thanks again to patreon supporter uh, cod bo 2 rgm2 i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you do remember hit that like button down below subscribe if you had already and i will see you guys in the next one bye